the voluptuous princess puts on a mask and sets out into the streets of Paris in search of a tasty prey. Soon a handsome man caught her eye. And the man had just been robbed of his horse and pack. He was penniless and in need of the princess's help. Alors pour toi, ce sera gratuit. Then the two of them squeezed into the narrow aisle and had sex. After a few moments of pleasure, the princess donned a blue cloak and disappeared into the crowd without leaving her name. Meanwhile, a cruel plot was brewing in the palace. The queen mother, Catherine, sent an assassin to shoot M. Wunkalani, the leader of the Protestants. As his life hangs in the balance, the thousands of Protestants who have come to the wedding become enraged. Tensions between Catholics and Protestants intensified. Catherine had no choice but to coerce her son, Charles IX, into ordering the extermination of all Protestants in the city. This massacre of Protestants began in August and lasted until October, known as the Saint Bartholomew's Day Massacre.